My name is Nickel, oh Nickel, and I just wanted to make this quick video to let you guys know that we now have the second skin to be revealed that was hinted at earlier today. So if you didn't catch a video earlier today, we've actually had a Soldier 76 epic skin that was revealed, which you can see right here. It kind of has a cobra on its back and looks a bit more evil than the normal Soldier 76. Well, in that tweet, they originally said that there was going to be two skins revealed, and now we know what the second one is. So, so the Overwatch Twitter account posted a tweet that said, Overwatch Anniversary 2018 begins next week, but we're starting the celebration with item reveals our second reveal lightning tracer This is actually an epic skin also, and is very interesting. A lot of people are actually comparing this to the whole Sombra, can I see your manager hair, but the Tracer edition. So as you see here, she kind of has this little faux hawk that's all blonde, and then her entire body is and yellow. And it actually says lightning on her leg. It is pretty interesting that they're starting off by showing us the epic skins, especially since we haven't seen epic skins in so long, that now we're just getting two epic skins right away at the same time. The big question I have for you guys is which do you guys prefer between the two epic skins we've seen so far? Soldier 76's Venom skin or Tracer's Lightning skin? The biggest thing with Tracer is that she has the ear piercings and hair that has been really changed over, but a lot of it is kind of reminiscent of the normal skin, just like a normal epic skin would be. And here you you can actually see the shoulder patch that you would expect as well. It also has like a lightning bolt going on the side of the gun too. There's actually a lot of really funny responses to this when it was announced via Twitter. There was somebody named Lee J Animation that posted the Brendan Fraser meme replacing Tracer's hair, which I probably laughed at too much. But beyond that, the reaction to the skin seems to be all over the place. A lot of people are making fun of it, and some people seem like they like it. It was definitely a lot more of a varied reaction than the Venom skin that we got earlier today. Another comparison by somebody named Vetro compared this guy from The Incredibles to the new Tracer skin, probably because the eye patch and the way the hair looks and everything. So it sounds like they're gonna be introducing a lot of the skins leading up to the events, and if you guys missed all the details on exactly what we're getting, we're actually gonna be getting eight legendary skins in total, and three of them are gonna be epics. So we already know two of the epics, there's only one final epic we haven't seen yet and on the flip side we know one of the legendary skins which is the pirate junkrat skin so we have seven of those remaining as well typically what they like to do is slowly reveal all of them out into the final day where they'll leave one or two as a surprise in the actual event itself and if you guys remember that chart that we made showing when everyone else got skins and based on that chart who we thought was going to get a skin revealed, Tracer was definitely at the top of that list, and it looks like that was actually true after all. The only reason we were able to somewhat predict that was just based on the frequency of when she last got one, which isn't always an indicating case, but it made sense as of here. But let me know down below in the comments what you guys think will be the next hero to get a new skin revealed. I actually saw a pretty interesting conversation when it came to the dapper hints, because there was also a hint from Jeff Kaplan that one of these skins will have a dapper look, and a lot of people thought Thought it was not the obvious Doomfist guess because as soon as they said that the tuxedo Doomfist was at the top of my mind because that's what people have requested for a long time but a lot of people threw out other dapper looking heroes one of the popular ones was a dapper Genji one was having Winston in a suit or one of the ones that I completely didn't even expect was Torbjorn in a suit. That one seemed to get quite a bit behind it as well. And we do know it's supposed to be a male hero based on the way Jeff Kaplan said it, but maybe that will be the next one that we end up getting. If I remember correctly, the way they did it when they gave the hint for the Retribution event, he told us it was going to be a Soldier 24 Reaper skin, but we didn't actually see it until right before the event came out. So it actually was not revealed right after he said what it was or hinted at it. But anyway, like I said, let me know down below in the comments, do you like the Tracer skin better or the Soldier 76 and why? And who do you think is up next? Don't forget to drop a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and we've actually teamed up with Razor to do a giveaway, so if you want to enter into that giveaway, hit the Gleam link at the top of the description. I've been doing pretty much daily live streams over on facebook.com slash onickel, so if you want to stop by and say hello, definitely hit that link in the description as well. But either way, thanks a lot for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.